on reinventing retail. There's so many fun ways out there that brands are encouraging people to shop online without ever opening a wallet. So I'm gonna take you on a little bit of a trip. Okay, that looks like the worst place in the universe. A little bit better, but I still think we could do better. Okay, that's beautiful. That is actually the 1888 Hotel in Sydney where I had the pleasure of, of spending some time when I was in Australia last year. So let's see how much money it takes to spend a night at the 1888 Hotel. Holy moly, okay, luckily that is not in currency. That is in Instagram followers. Now at the 1888 Hotel, they branded themselves as the world's first social media hotel. And they think if you are influential enough online to have 10,000 Instagram followers, they would rather have your marketing than your money. So if you're gonna post photos of staying in the hotel, they would rather not take money from you and your stay is free. So with that in mind, let's go on a little bit of a day trip. Randy's Retail Roundup, where cash is not the only currency. I need to get work on my game show voice a little more. All right, our first stop is going to be the Bird's Eye Restaurant in London. And you guessed it based on what I just showed you at the 1888 Hotel. All you have to do is take a picture of your food, show the waiter that you posted it online, and your meal is free. So there you go. Even in designer shops like Marc Jacobs, they're starting to think about this a little more. Marc Jacobs has started to do these pop-up shops where you can get their fancy perfumes, handbags. Again, you just show that you posted it online and based on how many followers you have, they tell you what you can get for free. So maybe you can get like some perfume, a handbag, a car, I don't know, Channing Tatum. <laughs> a girl can drink, sorry, my husband's in the audience, so I should not have posted that. Um, <laughs> Um, but as you can, so let's continue because maybe you're going to look at me and say, okay, I don't have Instagram, Twitter, to which I would say, congratulations, you're mysterious. The rest is, you know, welcome to 1980 or something. Um, but okay, but that's okay. There's more ways to participate in this new kind of economy than just social media. Uh, so I want to take you to the merit shop where you pay with your skills, not with currency. So at the Merit Shop, you can look online, you can see, okay, you know, iPod Shuffle, some gloves, sneakers. Okay, when you see that banner for sold out, you can actually click and see what talent someone had to do in order to get that. So that's a pretty good pair of sneakers. I imagine someone had to share something with some good merit, so let's see. Hello, everyone. So this is my top skill. I'm going to teach you today how to uh, make the honk sounds. <laughs> so, before I can... Yes, that was quite an interesting talent. So you see, we all have talent. Now, before I continue, I've heard that our Lord Mayor has a pretty interesting talent. And uh, we're going to invite him on stage to share. <laughs> so, if you were going to win something from the merit shop, what talent would you share? I can't beat honking. <laughs> But what I will do today, perhaps, Randy, is to auction my suit. Now, this is one of the last squires who's lot number one today, ladies and gentlemen. Who'll start me away? Is it $500? Five hundred dollars five hundred dollars five hundred dollars I have that seven. At seven hundred, I'll be about seven, 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 one dollar, seven, seven hundred we have. At eight hundred dollars for the suit, ladies and gentlemen. This is a lovely suit. Well worn. At eight hundred, I have. Eight hundred dollars of the nine now. Look at my thousand. At a thousand dollars for the suit. At one thousand, at eleven hundred, one thousand, one thousand now. At one hundred, one thousand, one hundred, one thousand now. At eleven hundred, please. At eleven hundred, I ask for.
participate in. And uh, thank you again. That takes a lot of guts to come on stage and, and share a talent. Um, so let's say that you say to me after all that, I don't have social media, I don't have a talent. Well, it's okay. There, there's still a few more ways you can participate in this new retail economy. Here is a new denim store that's starting to take off around, uh, especially the US and Europe, uh, where you don't actually engage with a human inside the store at all. Um, you go in, you scan if you like to try on a pair of jeans, a robot brings them to the dressing room for you, and then if you like them, again, scan, they arrive on your doorstep. And let's say this whole day has made us really uh, tired or exhausted. Well, Dewey Egberts has a coffee machine that you, if you yawn when you walk by, it dispenses free coffee for you. <laughs> so personally, I would like it better if it dispensed margaritas, but <laughs> I'll, I'll, it's, it's 10 o'clock in the morning, so I'll, I'll take coffee. Um, so reinventing retail, start thinking about, you know, maybe you're not going to be giving away free things in your business, but start thinking, are, is there a subset of your customers that their marketing would matter more to you than their money?